Hello everyone, so this is our solution foodbank.ai. Basically, uh, what we are going to aim is that we want to use a platform that can connect to uh, food donors with NGOs. What will happen that uh, when food donors will connect to the right NGOs based on their donation capacity, so they will know that yes, we are donating our food to an NGO that really needs it. And on the other hand, on the flip side, we are going to connect NGOs with the right donors so that NGOs can connect to those donors that are willing to give donations only up to the capacity what the NGO is in need at the moment. So how does this solution is going to work? So when a donor or an NGO will come to our solution, uh, this kind of homepage will appear. And here you can see uh, it is asking whether you are an uh, you are a donor or an NGO and just above it I have given a one liner of uh, explaining what we are going to achieve. So when you will click on this drop down it will uh, give you two options first is donor and first an NGO so let's say you are a donor you will click on donor and when you will click on donor uh, this uh, interactive page will appear and here it is saying welcome to the donor section now here what you can do you uh, you have an uh, you, you can submit a, uh, like these type of uh, food categories in donation and how you can uh, submit it by just clicking on choose an option you can uh, choose whichever type of food that you want to submit let's say you want to submit seafood let's say you want to submit fruits or bakery item okay and on the sidebar what will happen is that uh, you will get a counter that you can uh, uh, here you can mention how much uh, how many items of food bags that you want to donate let's say we want to donate two and you will see here that interactively it will change right away let's say we want to donate four bags of fruits and uh, three bags of bakery and when uh, the user will click on find ngo what will happen is that based on your donation level and food options the most suitable ngo is nordic food bank okay in the future we will try our best to include uh, contact details and phone numbers as well with email address uh, right now the model is trained on synthetic data so it is uh, not the real uh, food bank but uh, in future our aim is to uh, join hands with food banks and donors so that we can train our model on the real world data now here is a feedback form people can enter feedbacks about uh, how uh, about their experience with the app now let's say you are not a donor or you are an ngo okay and you are clicking here now let's say um you you need the uh, these kind of items and when you will click on find ngo so you will see that uh, the most suitable donor is nordic food bank again so why nordic food bank the aim is to allow uh, people who have access with them who are in need let's say nordic food bank is a food bank that received uh, uh, a lot of donations and now the food bank itself is uh, claiming to be a donor and they want to give away the excess food to other ngos so they can connect uh, like them as well and again the feedback form about the user experience so that was a very quick and short intro about uh, the application our uh, aim is to grow it and make it more optimized and personal to food banks and donors. Thank you for watching and I'll see you uh, in the most latest updated version very soon.